Hobbs are good. There's no sign of further infection. You're on the mend, Miss Jansen. Word on the street is Dr. Warner's the best. Oh, he's OK. Will I get a chance to thank him before I leave? I'll see if he's got time to come in. That'd be great. Are you feeling up to a shower? Totally, yes. I need to unmank. I'll, uh, I'll go and get you a waterproof dressing. How's my number one fat fighter holding up? Look at me. I'm beautiful. Can't wait to show the rest of the world, or at least New Zealand. Yeah, about that. Uh, the show might not go ahead. What's happened? My key footage has gone bye-bye. No. Mm -hmm. Somebody helped themselves to my memory cards and wiped the ops hands. Well, who would do that? I... I have my suspicions, but no one's fessing up. So now I am in the unenviable position of not having a show. No show means no sponsors, which means... No car. Mm -hmm. No holiday, no new clothes, not even that new job we lined up at the gym. Unless you help me. Well, of course, but how? Oh, look, we'll just talk details later, eh? No, tell me now. I'll do anything you want. Is everything all right here? Yeah, absolutely. Um, I'll be back as soon as I can. What's going on, Jim? Can I just have my shower, please? How's it going with the money pit? Uh, well, some mug put in a higher offer. Was it you? Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, what a relief. Hmm? Um, it's my real estate agent. A deposit's just come through from another buyer. Come on, tell me, are you the other buyer? I am. I can't believe you actually did this for me. Thank you. It's my pleasure. Now, make sure you get the builder's report to the agent. Get your money back as fast as you can. How about a celebratory coffee first? Make it a butterfly kiss. <laughs> She's not going anywhere, apart from down the track really fast. <laughs> well, it looks like a weight's been lifted. A whole house. Henry came through with a deposit. I'll have to pass on that coffee. I have got a sale and purchase agreement to tear up. He's a lamb begging to be fleeced, that one. Mm. But I wouldn't let her up my sight if I was here. Why? Well, she's not the best of money, RJ. Wants to stop her spotting something else she fancies on her way home. Another house, a uh, yacht. I'll see you later. Hunter, hi. How are you feeling today? I'm hanging in there. I might head off. Uh, give me a call later, eh? OK. Relax. I'm not going to lose the plot again. I, I was worried it was something I said. Oh, what is it with people blaming themselves for things around here? I just thought it would be better to clear the air. Sorry. I, I guess I'm not coping as well as I thought. Well, you don't have to do the whole thing alone. I can help. I'll keep you posted on that one. Yvonne. Tell me if I'm overstepping the mark. What is it? Anita and I had a drink last night, and she said more than I think she meant to. About Ben? Yeah. Something went down between them. I don't know what. But the way she clammed up when I asked, it must have been something major. You think that's why she's clinging to Ben like this? Not letting him go? I don't know, maybe. It takes a lot of courage and commitment to do what you've done. What? Stop eating fish and chips on a daily basis? Hardly worth the medal? Where to from here? Um, I don't know. Baby steps, I guess. The best kind. Miss Jansen, you are now free to roam. It's been a pleasure. Same. Thanks. Now, don't rush. You've had major surgery only a few days ago. My sister's double parked outside. I'm good. Am I missing something? Ursula. One minute, Jim is fine, praising you, pretty much asking to marry you. Then Ursula walks in. And upsets her. Obviously. Well, what about, though? <sighs> Have you heard from Jane at all? Uh, weren't you supposed to be keeping an eye on her? I lost her and she's not answering her phone. Do you know if she got her deposit back? I have no idea. Why? Can't get hold of the agent, either. She's not answering her call. Disconnected. 
The main officers have never heard of her or the house. Then where the hell's your 160 grand got, mate? Well, that's what I'd like to know. What am I going to do? Find Jane. Yeah, this is, um, this is where she's staying. What if she's in on it? Yeah, because her and the agent are off to South America even as we speak. Come on, it's more likely there's just been a mix-up or something. Oh, there probably never was a deposit or even a house for sale. All good things you can ask Jane. Let's go on. Just in case she's heading for Chile. Right. He's needing increasing amounts of medication to keep his blood pressure up, and they're not working. I just heard. He's getting worse, isn't he? His kidneys have already started to fail. In the end, his heart will stop. What do you care? He's dead to you already, remember? Don't put him through this. Would you mind escorting Yvonne from the room, please? Accept what is right in front of you. He is gone. She's not family. I'm sorry. This is about you, not about Ben. I am taking care of my brother. Your brother's not here. Get her out. Please. Look at him. What? Just stop and think. What would Ben tell you to do? Why do people keep asking me that? Because you're his sister. You should know what he well, wants. Well, I don't know what he wants, OK? I don't know anything about him. I didn't know where he lived, where he worked. Nothing. How could I? He hasn't spoken to me for years because he hates me, and he should. And do me. you want to know what he would say to me? He'd say, get out of my sight. Ursula wants feedback. Oh, no, she doesn't. It's just a courtesy. So why are we bothering? Because you want to see yourself on TV. Don't bother denying it. <clears throat> Gemma Jansen, a young, vulnerable woman who put her trust in Dr. Chris Warner, a doctor who left mid-surgery because he needed coffee, a doctor beyond question, a doctor who thinks he's God. All right. Any feedback on this so far? 